What's going on, everybody? This is Kurt Rice at Kurt Rice Baseball. How's everybody doing? This fop, mm, excuse me, almost Wednesday morning by 11:59 p.m. Going into midnight. My next video on the All-Star catchers mitt. We're gonna do the palm. We're gonna go ahead and get this palm area fixed up both sides. So there's ways you can do it. You can do the palm, or you can do the perimeter. It's preference. Uh, people do it. Per, uh, palm and then go around this side of the perimeter or they go and then they come over here and do palm and then this rest of this perimeter or they do the perimeter and then go inside of the palm preferably I like to do the palm area first uh, just for the simple reason of uh, I can flip it up and see where I need to hit my hole some of these holes are you know you got to go through the right through the padding here on these all-star mitts so without further ado let's get started now i'm going to start on the pro elite side where it says pro elite these two holes are for the wet web area stuff like that here is your starting point right here sorry let me get that in the shot All right. see this is where i like to flip it up and go in perfect what you want to do go under there come out bottom hole right there okay tie you a knot single knot that's what it's going to look like right there okay all right Put a little twist going up Coming out right there, going up through there, coming out that hole right there. Right. there we go. So, what you got right there now? Gonna flip it, give it a twist. You want to see rough sides here, you don't want to. Keep turning your lace and it looks all funny. You're always going rough on the outside of the mitt. So make sure my lace is straight. Going through this hole right here. And out that hole right there. Funny angles on these mitts, I'm telling you. So we went through this one. If I can move that out of the way. Going out that hole right there. Okay. Now when you're doing when you're doing the doing the palm, try not to cinch it down too tight. You can I've seen people leave them loose through here. That way the perimeter is not so hard to close up like this. So just, just give it a cinch like this. Make sure you're good. You don't have to cinch it down tight. You, after you get done with your perimeter, uh, which is this part, you can go ahead and, you know, go ahead and cinch it on down. Next step, through this hole right here and out through the bottom hole, out that hole right there. Okay. Go. You can always come back and cinch that down if you need to. Okay. All right. Do this hole. Can't find it. Okay, we'll find it. Come in. You gotta angle it in. Right there. See there. This is why I kind of like to leave the palm area up. So you, all, you can see all your holes you go in and out. Palm area open there. And you want to go, you want to angle it down. Just like that. Perfect. Make sure I got my lace straight. There it is. So I went in. Went in this bottom hole here. Went through there. Through there, angled it down, coming out 
that side right there. That stuck here. Rough side on the outside of the glove right there. Okay. You should be good. Uh, you don't have like I said, you don't have to pull it too tight. So now right here we are going through the palm area, I believe. Yes, we are going through the palm area. So what you do going up under up under here and see where you come out right there there's your holes for the palm right there you want to come out this hole right here just angle it right there you're gonna come out up under the thumb loop right there so if I can get that on the light right there went in this hole under the padding, right there is my needle coming out through here. Now I'm going to pull it through. Go. Perfect. Right there. Good deal. Like I said, I can always go through and tighten them up. Now we're rough side here. Rough side here, going in where the thumb loop is, going in there, find your hole on the other side, right there, see it, going up, angle it down, going in at a big angle here, so look, there it is, we're on the thumb side, right there is your Pro Elite, going in that bottom hole, Right there, going through the padding. There's my needle. Let's see if I can see. There it is. My needle's right here. There it is. Angling it down. Making sure we go in. Going in the rough side up. Go. Right. There. See there? It matches all of this right here. See that? Go. All right. Now, going through. Last but not least, we're going through this hole. Now, as you notice, there's no other holes to go in. So on, on this side, you notice see that little indention right there that's where it's gonna come out okay so you're not going through the mitt at all you're going down at an angle you have to lift it up fill it up in there there it is right there you're not even going through the through the padding or nothing you're coming out the out the side right there right there coming out All right. cinch it up just a little there we go from here all the way around right there now what we're gonna do we are going to snip it snip it long enough to where you get a where you can tie a little single knot right there. Okay. Hopefully I did. If not, I'll show you a little trick for that. And I barely did. Let me get this in the shot. So a single single knot. Now if you cut it too short and you can't fully get it through there, get you some pliers. Grab the end you're trying to pull through. I can reach in there and get it right there. Now you're gonna cinch it up. There we go. Now I got enough to where I can tighten it down. There we go. 
Boom. Now I'll include that. I don't need all that much sticking out. There we go. All right. That is one side of the palm done. And I will pause the video, get my lace ready, and we will go ahead and I don't know if I got enough lace to do the other side. We might. But I'm just going to go ahead and use a whole brand new piece of lace in just a second. That way we don't have run into any issues. So I'm not even going to pause the video. Go. Snip it. Give it a good snip. Place my needle here. Alrighty. Go. And on this side. A single knot. Just like we did the other side. Okay. Just like we did the other side. <clears throat> Go. It doesn't have to be a long go. Just like that. Snip it. Other side of the palm. We are going. Start. We're on the all kind of on the all-star side now. This bottom hole right here. And flip it up. See your hole. And out. That hole right there. Okay. There go. Got a new piece of lace in it. Just being safe. Okay. <clears throat> Going through here. Next hole. Have to flip this up. Going out. That hole right there. In this hole, where profile toe is, out the back. That hole right there. Okay. Go. Uh, there we are. Alright. One rough side here. Let me get them scissors out the way before I cut myself. Alright. I could fast forward it, but I like to show you guys how to do it the right way. I don't like fast forward and stuff because it doesn't really, doesn't really do anything. I like showing people how I do it. All right, next hole, bottom of that, and let it down. I'm through that hole right there. Okay, you're gonna be rough side on the outside of the glove. Just remember that. Outside is going to be rough side. Okay. Mm -hmm. Sorry, I'll get that back in the shot for you, folks. Mm -hmm. Go on here. Here's the hole in the patty. Going up, angling it in. That's what we got. Through that hole, through the padding. Out the back. You don't want to come in these top holes. That's perimeter, okay? You want to come on these bottom sets right here, okay? Bottom sets of holes. All right, there we go. Pulling it through. Lay straight. Sorry about that. Didn't mean to hit the camera. There we go. All right. Good to go. Right. Should be getting to that one point. Getting close. All right. In this hole, flip it up. There's the hole there, padding. Angling it down. See there? Out that hole right there. Okay, there we are. Again, this hole, you can flip it up if you need to. 
There it is. Right there. One in. Back of that hole right there. Okay. There. One through. Angle up. Through there. And out the other side. Okay. Got to get a little twist there. Twist there. All right. Good twist there. Make sure I do this right for you. We're gonna go in this hole. We are coming out. I believe it's the top. No, go on. Is it the top? I believe it's the top. Yeah, top side, right there, through here, and through the top, right there. Get it around, a little twist there. There we go. Okay, we're good for now. Mm -hmm. Good twist. Almost there, folks. Going down. Yep, right there. And we're gonna angle it, okay? Go. So now what I did is I went here at the bottom. Okay, came out the top. Came out the top here, came down. We're angling it, going under that, and now we're going out that hole right there okay deal right do a little twist there we're almost done okay Put in that hole whoops sorry about that folks Got that hole right there, the padding. Angle it down. We'll come out. You'll feel it go through there. So what we do, these they got some funny angles on these mitts, I'm gonna tell you. So I angled it down, going down through there. Let me pull that out, see if I can show you. Right there, see there? Coming out at an angle, right through there. Go stuck. It gets turned on you. Just get a little twist. Go just like that. Okay. Got worn and we got this palm area relaced. I'm in that hole. It's all right. We can tighten all that down. I'm gonna angle this up. In this hole, and gonna angle it up. So we go through, go through there, We're going through at an angle, and it's coming up right there. So we wanna come up through this hole right there. Okay, there it is, coming up through that hole. In this one, through at an angle, going up, coming in right there. And let's see here. I have a really bad habit of twisting this, this lace. Let me go the other way. There we go. And got it. Right there. That's what we got. Okay. Almost there, folks. Okay. This is the palm of the area of the all-star mitt. Okay. Going in that hole there. In that hole. Angle. Coming out. Angle right there. See that? Can y'all see that? Yes. Okay. There. 
coming out. Make sure this is straight when I pull it through. It is not. There we go. Now it's straight. Right there. Sorry about that, folks. I think I twist a lace in every video, and <laughs> I have to pull it back. I had to pull it out of camera there real quick. Make sure your lace is straight. <laughs> I have horrible times sometimes on these videos. I don't know why. I, will, I don't do it while I'm relacing a glove and I'm by myself, but go through that hole. You're gonna angle it down. You'll see it pop through there. Just like that. Okay. Get that off. Yar. Do that right there. Okay. So what we got. Last but not least. And this hole right here, not a hinge, I'm going to angle it I said these things, they got the funniest angles on them I've ever seen Alright, sure it's straight Okay, we're going in, right there, the bottom, coming out there Now you're going to Exit right here. Right there. This is where your single knot's gonna be tied off. Okay. There. Good flip. Twist it. There we go. I probably had enough to uh do the with the other lace, but that's okay. I got plenty of lace here. That's what we do. This is what it's for. Cut you enough to make a single knot. I'm gonna cut quite a bit. If I gotta cut enough off, I'll cut it. Here we are. We're gonna make a single knot. Come around through here. Get it really tight. Get it up as close to that glove as you can. There we go. There we are. You don't need that much access sticking out, so we're going to snip that. Don't snip the glove. There we go. And there you are. That is your whole palm area on an all-star catcher's mitt. You can go through here and tighten these up. I'll do that later when I do the perimeter and stuff. So there you are. That's what it looks like around the back. Right here. Knot to knot. Right there. This one goes not, and then comes out through this side right here. If anybody has any questions, leave a comment down below. This is Kurt Rice at Kurt Rice Baseball. Y'all have a blessed day.